Welcome to our video tutorial. In this video, we're going to show you how to use the freehand tool in Pecan Planner. This tool is used to freely insert forms or curved lines into your plan. The drawing process for a freehand line differs from that of other 2D drawing elements. In this case, you don't click each point. Instead, you'll click just once to create the starting point of the line. From there, hold the left mouse button down and draw the desired path. Once you release the mouse button, the drawing process will end. Freehand lines are based on splines, a method for interpolating lines between nodes. You can make these nodes visual by double-clicking on the line you would like to edit. Now, if you move individual points with your mouse, the shape of the line should adjust accordingly. The interactors at the end of the open freehand line will allow you to adjust the curvature of the line without changing its length. Depending on the complexity of your line, as well as how much editing you have done so far, you may find that many unnecessary nodes have appeared. To delete these extra nodes, Pecan Planner offers the Simplify feature. You can find this option under the context menu by right-clicking with your mouse or by simply pressing Y on your keyboard. Just below, using the shortcut L, you will find the close function. As the name suggests, this function will create a closed element from an open freehand line. In this case, the two vertices will connect to one another. And just one small tip before we leave you to it. For example, by combining the freehand tool with the follow me tool, you can easily draw and follow the progression of cables. Using the properties editor, you can also experiment with other settings, such as changing the line color and type. And of course, don't forget to let your creativity run wild. More information on using Pecan Planner can be found in our help center and by watching our other video tutorials. Have fun planning and experimenting!